to Gaw TV. Yes, that's a hashtag. Your ladies are here. Myself, Mickey James, Lisa Marie, SoCal Val. But hey, you can find all this in the descriptions. But make sure, make sure before we get started to like this video now, comment below, tell us you love us, click that bell icon. Oh, she got a yay. Val, you need to get one now. I know, I'm left out. Subscribe. Please subscribe and tell all your friends to come join us here at God TV now and every, every Wednesday. That's right. That's right. Your weekly dose of grown ass women is right here on YouTube. And of course, you're getting the fabulous half hour of content. But if you'd like the full enchilada, ladies and gentlemen, you need to join patreon.com slash God TV, where we give you the full hour, the full unfiltered version of God TV, also available on podcasts. We'll get to that in a moment. But we also want to say that the party is so much fun here on YouTube. Hello to everyone in the chat room. We love the live interaction. But we're going to up the ante and tell you that on patreon.com slash God TV at the top of the hour, 6 p.m. Eastern, all three of us will be in the live chat, which is a Zoom after party. Everyone on Patreon is invited. We have dance parties. We have live cheers, everyone on camera. So make sure that you join Patreon so you get the full <laughs> God TV experience, bonus footage, and all sorts of perks on God TV's Patreon. So exciting. So exciting, Val. But I can't help to notice that beautiful pillow behind you. Why this one? <laughs> that one right there. Um, it's too one? bad you don't. It's too bad you don't have a face mask though. You know, I wish Dang. I did. That Hang on, hold the phone. Whoa! Oh, no, oh. grown ass oh. woman. Yeah, baby. I'm and you can get these. Over. You can get these items at our Teespring store, which our link is in the description and probably possibly floating over our faces right now. Mm. That's a beautiful mask. Look at that. Look at that. It just brings your eyes out, you guys. It's a it must. Really it's a must. And you have to get the fanny pack, right, you guys? Oh, yes. Oh, who doesn't need a fanny pack? A fanny pack and a mask? That's 2021 in a nutshell right there. Represent oh, in a nutshell. <laughs> the good thing about our store is, like, these, these are conversation stars. So someone might go, someone that's, you know, living under a rock might say, what's God TV? And you say, well, hey, we're representing our weekly favorite show on YouTube. There's so much merchandise, Lisa. You're so right. T-shirts, got you you name it, like just you you name it, and it's also Legacy Subs is one of our sub our, our sponsors too. So it's very interesting, you know. You'll 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 get the deets on below about the Legacy Subs, Mickey James Company, and um, I'm excited to try the. Uh, what's the one you recommend for me? Simma 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 down now. Simma down, simma down now. <laughs> Maybe. I needed to. I just calm, it, calm as a cucumber. <laughs> <laughs> calm as a cucumber. I'm just chilling like a villain. Mm -hmm. No, it's so good. Honestly, it might have taken over because I told you the um the the other sleep aid that we were we were having, and I don't know why its name is escaping me right now because Simma Down has taken over. You know, yeah. I just got my first batch in. I gosh, I didn't have enough space oh. to put them over, but they, Thanks for shouting me out, Lisa, with the LegacySups.com. Yes, and her legacy, you can use code GAW, G-A-W, right now and get your percentage off of everything in the store. Ships worldwide, all over, you name it. It's exciting. It's exciting. Thank you. Yep, yep. Awesome we didn't monster. need more reasons to be proud of our girl, Mickey James. I mean, empower yeah. and just you being a grown ass woman, Lisa as well. But but Mickey, we are so proud of LegacySups.com and, and so grateful for that fantastic um, discount code for all of our Team Gaw members here. But as you said, you know, not only do we have um, Legacy Subs to thank, we've got Drunk Elephant as well, who is our special, special sponsor on this episode. And we have so much to discuss. And look oh. at that display. Mickey James just has, look at, all, look at all the products they offer. And this is just a minimal, like, amount of it. And oh. I, like, for me, that, that's a beautiful setup. And then show them that box, how it's shipped to you. Look at oh, that. Oh, my God. It's such a cute little box. It's such a cute little box. No, huge thanks to our sponsor, uh, Drunk Elephant. Look at this. An elephant walks into a bar. Here, I have to move up away so you can see it. But all, it's such a cute little box. I would show the whole thing, but it has my address on it. Not doing that today. No, I wouldn't. Um, <laughs> no, you know what else I have to say? What's in the box? What's in the box? What's in the box? <laughs> this 
Nice came in that box. All of my wow. products came in the box. I do want to say too, also a huge shout out to the Gallcast, our weekly podcast that you can find the full episode. Yes, you get the full video version on Patreon, patreon.com backslash Gall TV, but we also have our Gallcast brought to you by our lovely uh, Ella from a wrestling gal. Thank you, Ella, for putting this together, for helping us kick down all those podcast doors or ear holes, however you look at it. Hmm. And, and huge shout out to Chapel Heart, our guest last week. Oh, and the yeah. Of Grown Ass Woman being the official theme song for Empower. My latest, my latest, my latest, my latest. Yes, I'm very excited. Very, very excited. They were so fabulous. I think, um, I think Val and I were just, we kept unboxing you and saying, thank you so much. Those girls were a freaking amazing, like just, oh, it's so down to earth. And so like, I, I felt like I know, I known them for so long, Mickey. Right. It's like, thank you for introducing us to that. We are so oh, grateful. Honestly, girl. the second they came on camera, this is what we were saying in, in private boxes to each other, that the second they came on camera, I was like, these are some fabulous women right, women right here. They're so lovely, so down to earth, as Lisa mentioned, and just absolute powerhouses. That episode of Gaw TV from last week is of course available on replay here on YouTube. And of course the full version is on the hashtag Gawcast and on Patreon. But ladies, you know, we we have uh we've kind of come back to our roots here haven't we in terms of oh. when we started this show you know we we had very much a slumber party theme in mind a little glass of wine maybe do some skincare that's what girls do that's what ladies do when they're having you know girl time and downtime and we've come you know as, as bare faced as much as much as we could muster here on the episode because we're highlighting all of our favorite drunk elephant products but before we get to that we have to do our favorite part of the show which is Woo! who are you wearing what are you drinking? I want to go to Miss Lisa Marie first because you're already glowing and you haven't even put your skincare on yet. Oh, I put a little bit of their, their skincare on. Um, okay. I, I couldn't go completely barefaced, but I'm going to show you what I did use okay. from the, okay. the drunk elephant. I'm telling you. But I am drinking. Uh, I had David uh, go to Costco or Bethlo to get me more wine. Um, Chateau Saint Michel. <gasps> Michel. That's one of my favorites. Oh, you know it? That's one of my favorites. No way. Yes. Is it really? A beautiful it's, Riesling. Mm-hmm. It's, it is. I'll be honest with you. I can tell the difference. I, I, I really can. It, you know, it, I'm not super snobby about my wine, but it is delicious. And David goes, well, I just bought you four like a couple days ago. I go, yeah, we had a Zoom chat and the after party and Patreon. And, you know, we filmed with the, you know, the, yeah, yeah. It, the chapel heart. Like we just go through it. But I'm wearing tonight. Well, of course, I have this because we're about to do our face, right? My mom, Moo Moo. Remember Chapel Heart? A Moo Moo. A Moo Moo. So I have my pajamas on that I'm wearing. I, I took a bath and I was like, oh my God, this is awesome. I don't have to look for an outfit to wear. This is what I wear every single night. With this every whole single theme, night. I was actually really excited because I was like, okay, so we have to put minimal makeup on, throw our hair up in a top knot, and wear, like, I'm wearing my skincare headband. And I actually, I'll, I'll tell you, I have, um, my own little um, kit of drunk elephant skincare that I have in my living room. So very often my husband will go to bed. He goes to bed early. I'm like, I, I got three more episodes of Housewives to watch. I got Drag Race to watch, brother, brother. So I sit downstairs <laughs> and I watch my stuff. And as I'm watching, I'm cleansing my face. I'm using my favorite drunk elephant uh, skincare products that we'll get to in a moment. And I have a little velour headband like this. And you know, just Love to kind of cheap. protect your hairline, not to mess up your hairdo. And I'm wearing one of my favorite uh, lace robes. I'm also representing my favorite this is my savior in lockdown slimline wine rosé zero calories zero carbs zero guilt <laughs> yeah i actually like the bottle how i like how plain the bottle is val it's very classy, yeah. classy. i almost yeah. didn't recognize it because there's still wine up to here so that's weird usually i'm just kidding. but um you guys you know, know, I how that's i tell you what's that i said i don't think i've seen the bottle didn't it come in the cans or is uh, that a different one? No, different one, different one. This is this is the one that I pretty much talk to you guys all the time about because you know if, if I'm gonna have some wine at night and like I said, do my skincare, have my own little girly routine, I need to have something that's like you know no carbs, zero sugar, all of that yeah. jazz. So this is beautiful, and I have to say the rosé is my favorite. I've tried their their uh, sparkling wine, I tried their white, their red, but the rosé is I've told every people must think that I'm sponsored by Slimline Wine. I'm not. I know. Uh, but I tell everyone about it as if I was because I love it so much. And it's just so refreshing. And I feel like it's a little bit girly because it's pink. So that's yeah. where we are. Well, we should be sponsored by it now. How many times you plugged it in? Huh? Hey, oh. 
<laughs> oh my God. Well, what I'm are you drinking? What, my... what are you wearing, Mickey? What are you wearing? Uh, well, I'm wearing my snuggly, snuggly, um, you know, my little spa robe. I love I'll it. This for year. Isn't that sweet? It's so comfortable. It, so comfortable. It's beautiful. And I'm drinking a little uh, Fresca and Vatsky, mm-hmm. you know? Fancy. And this glass from our wedding. These were a wedding gift, these glasses. Oh, careful. Yeah. They're like little crystal glasses. Well, it's a Oh, party. my God. She's Great. breaking out the good china for us, ladies and gentlemen. Seriously. I, I usually I'm thought that people... <laughs> I would think that you would have it on display and not use that. Well, what's the good in that? You know, I, I know. I really, like, yes, yes, there are some, but I have these old plates that honestly they have the gold and stuff, but the gold is pretty much wore off now because I've used them. And I go like, well, if I guess if I had a super, super nice set that had been passed down from generations, but here's the thing is that when you get sets, they're usually missing a piece. If they're yeah. the ham, if they're the half down, they're missing a couple pieces anyway, you know. And I think you got to use them because what other, what else are they going to do? Like collect us and just sit there. Well, that's the thing. I you agree. Like when you were younger, like you had, like your grandmother had, like the nice china, or she had like the good jewels, and you think, I don't know about you guys, but like the, the pandemic and you know Miss Rona herself, Miss Rona, if you're nasty, has taught me. <laughs> no one, no one, no one's going to be like believe me they're gonna be like Val you wear crazy stuff all the time I get that but it's taught me to sort of like stop waiting to wear that big necklace stop waiting to wear that perfect dress or you know using the good china just do it enjoy it life is here to be enjoyed you know we're not a plastic couch like from the 1970s we're like oh don't touch that use it enjoy it embrace it right I agree I totally agree I totally agree and if I don't use something I get rid of everything now you guys know I do have a big cartel store, Lisa Marie Baron, uh, dot big cartel dot com. <laughs> I'm selling all my my closet. If I'm not wearing it, let someone else enjoy it. I'm just, right. you know, you know, if I can make a buck or two extra help, you know, cell phone bill, you know, I still have to make a living, you guys. You know, I'm not rolling in the dough driving my Rolls Royce. <laughs> but yeah, which one? I, I say I say use it as as it and 40 year old version. Remember. Remember 40-year-old virgin? Is it true? If you don't use it, you lose it. Do you remember that line? Yeah, and no, but, but honestly, like, that's actually a really funny metaphor because in the, in that movie, what, oh my God, one of the funniest movies ever, he has all these toys in these like shrink wraps and like, oh, it's a limited edition, blah, blah, blah. And she ends up helping him sell it. It's like, listen, this could mean something to someone else. You're just, it's just collecting dust in your shelf. So if you're watching right now and you're thinking, you know, oh, it's, I got to wait for the day to break that stuff out. Listen, today's the day. So you grab that good china. If it breaks, we're not, you know, don't, please don't sue us or, or, or message anyone. I got <laughs> don't break your I have, a, I have a question for you guys. Okay, so I did a signing. Have you guys done this? They give you your action figure and they film you opening your action figure out of the box. And I'm like, oh, wait, wait. Are you sure this is worth money when it's already wrapped up? And they're like, no, open it. And I go, I'm really uncomfortable with this. I go, I just bought a couple of my action figures myself online. They're kind of pricey mm-hmm. and I, they had me open it to see my reaction and I was I never actually touch my action figure with my hands out of the Listen, box Lisa if you can't touch yourself who can that's my philosophy yeah right anyone yeah. anyone at home Bueller <laughs> touch yourself yeah. before you wreck yourself you heard it here first on God TV <laughs> yeah. <a> hashtag <laughs> Wow. You set that up so well, Lisa. I couldn't help. Have you me. guys done that though? Have you opened an action figure for a fan, like on camera? <laughs> Touched ourselves? Like, no, no open the action. Well, <laughs> no, I I'm have not. not ta- done I'm not that. talking five minutes ago, Mickey. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness gracious! I'm like, heaven. no, I haven't opened my package on television. Wait till you do Comic Cons. It's, you it's a new thing. On television, that's also not okay. I mean, I don't know why is this conversation. This is okay. Everyone watching in the chat room, when it's just <laughs> us three together, have you noticed all the innuendos that just flow? I think we have to be on our best behavior when there's a guest. Guess what, ladies and gentlemen? There's no guest tonight, so wrap <laughs> in. Wow. wow, wow, we're really doing right. it. Welcome to the locker room. This is how the locker room is. We're doing the most. <laughs> Doing the the most. There are some people that do the absolute most. Do we want to talk about people who do the most in life? Mm-hmm. You know, that just go the extra mile, that really work it, you know, 
ask the most questions. It can be good questions. and bad though, can't it? Like doing the most is like, it's, right? No, good, doing the most is not a good thing. Like there's doing the most of like excelling and doing and doing, and then there's doing the most. Do you know what I mean? You're at a Is that when we say doing bless doing their heart? Is that when we say bless their heart? Yeah. Bless them. Yeah. <laughs> bless them. Which is it's our friend Ginger Minge, also a former ga uh, guest. Uh, bless your heart is Southern for F you. So, hey, however you want to. <laughs> it's we fitting. all have the fans that say that. So we know, we know. Bless your heart. Yes. Bless oh my your gosh. Heart. Oh my I gosh. so many blessed hearts in my life. Wow. Mm. <laughs> me too, me too, me too. I'm sure people say it behind my back several times, several times. <laughs> but you guys are looking so beautiful. Thanks to Drunk Elephant. What is your guys' favorite um, products in this God, this, just all this product. I have too much. I can't pick one. I know. We we, we did. We, you know, we, um, we we try to keep it organic here on God TV, but we did say to each other, like, let's try to pull some of our favorite products. And did you guys? Honestly, I'm not trying to be funny. I had problems figuring out which products to pull because I I have not. I swear on Sasha Valor. There she is. I swear <laughs> on my spirit on Sasha Valor. You know, I wouldn't kid around that every single product I've used, I've gone. I'm not sure if I'm gonna love it, and I love every single one. Honestly. Yeah, they're great. But ladies, really what, what's really spoken to you? What, what's, what's been your drunkest elephant? <laughs> <laughs> I'll say the one that you turned me on to might be my new favorite, this, uh, bo this butter. This, and it comes, you can see my little dirty spatula here. Sorry, but it's got <laughs> a little magnet dirty on spatula. the back. That's my drag name. How did you know? Dirty spatula. Dirty spatula. <laughs> yeah. But it has like a little, it has a little magnet on the back and look, it just, boop, so you don't lose it. And it takes uh, just a little bit. I've gotten, well, it's really dug in there. Yeah. Mine too. But, and yeah. It's, yeah. It's, why are you and, laughing and at it, how I dig it? it, it you didn't watch how I dug it, though? That doesn't look like a spatula. Was that your fingernails? <laughs> no, I swear it's a spatula. I'm a digger. I get a little scoop, you yeah. know? Well, baby, spin. and then I get it on my fingers, and then get it because it's like butter, so it like goes on like the heart. Have you ever had that uh, cocoa butter? That I get the cocoa butter in the jar. It's very similar. You kind of scoop. It doesn't. Uh, Palmer's, if you're listening, I think it's Palmer's. The scoop get with the, the scoop. Back. Yeah, get the scoop, bro. Look, because it's the same. You put it on in a little bit, and you work it between your fingers, and it becomes like butter on your skin. But that's yep. this stuff melts your makeup off like I can do it like it's so gentle so I can do it all around my eye makeup and all around and I go in and gone and it, and it takes off your waterproof it, mascara right yep. yep right and it and it moisturizes as it goes because it's just nice and oil like good stuff so that might yep. be my new favorite thing I boxed you guys like when I when I when I first started using it I was like um have you guys because we, we we try things in different successions like we kind of go like oh I tried this one you know we, and that's what's wonderful is we didn't want to uh, and by the way thank you to drunk elephant drunkelephant.com for being so lovely to be our sponsor but we wanted to make sure that we didn't just immediately go here are the products let's promote them tomorrow we wanted to take time to actually try them all and the butter was something actually Lisa saw it on their website and said Oh, I really want to try that butter. Do you remember, Lisa? You were asking. Yes, me, I do. I do. Butter. Because I to try to, to get a good makeup remover. Yeah. I know you, the most chit chat for all guys, but to get this face makeup and then getting out of the shower without that raccoon eye yeah. is really hard to do. It really, really hard to do. And Mickey hit the nail on the head. The, 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 the key term here is melt. It literally melts your makeup away gently. And especially after filming, you know, I, I we film pretty late. So right now it's about 11 p.m. for me. Uh, when we film late, you know, I've got about a, a lot of caked on makeup and just a little tiny little spoonful, a little baby spoonful of that. And you just, it melts everything away. Everything's cleansed and lovely. And even like, we're talking, like Lisa said, waterproof mascara. I use now magnetic lashes sometimes. And that sort of eyeliner is very hard and very tough to get off of your face. It's honestly, right. I need to make you talk about it. Like that's probably my favorite new product they've given us. I was so grateful for that one. So Drunk Elephant, you know, when we first started, um, you can see episodes a uh, long time ago, we started with their skincare. They've now evolved into hair care. Uh, they take care of colored tresses, myself included. Don't be shocked, everyone in the chat room. Calm down. I'm not a real redhead, but here we are. Um, you know, for colored hair, even, you know, I, I went to my hairdresser and said, you know, is this okay to use? It's all fragrance free. It's amazing. And I have to tell you, that my favorite thing they've sent, other than the, the butter, was actually a scalp scrub. And it's called TLC 
Happy Scalp Scrub, and it is 10% 10 AHA, BHA blend, plant oils. And I want to show you guys the, 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 the packaging because, first of all, we always talk about how clever the packaging is, right? So when you travel, yeah. it just clicks into place, nothing spills. But with this, I was like, wow. So if you look at the, the applicator here, and I've used this so much, so it's probably going to look a bit rank now, sorry. Uh, with this, so what you would do is you would uh, part your hair and just spread the scalp uh, scrub in here. And it's got, it's, it, it feels like it's a little bit vinegar based. So it basically, you know, scrubs your entire scalp, any sort of buildup. I have a very, very thick head of hair. I've got a lot of hair. I'm like, a, you know, big Texas, that's the, te the Texan in me, I guess. Um, and I tend to get a lot of buildup from, you know, hairspray and shampoos and things like that. This is like a wake up call for your hair. It's my favorite thing they've sent me. TLC Happy Scalp oh. Scrub. And uh, the you know what? The applicant, oh, you know what I'm wondering too? Like if it's a scalp scrub, you know how people are losing their hair? Yeah. I'm wondering if it, if it if it if it sloughs off the dead skin on your scalp so it yeah. unplugs your pores and yeah. prevents hair loss. I don't know about hair loss. I know it's not it's not a medical it's not medical, but yeah. that's part of why people lose their hair. Right. You know about me. I use I use stuff for my hair because I wear ponytails all the time and I wear my hair up so much. I am getting the receding hairline, and I'm gonna be honest with you, Val. Now I'm gonna try it because I'm gonna see oh, if that helps it. with my receding. Here, even your even as a female, never, females get that, you know, cleaner. like your hair will never feel cleaner. It just it just really gets rid of any sort of like, you know, we all use different things, dry shampoo, hairspray, you know, root lifter, all these things. Yeah. And, you know, especially for someone with really thick hair, it just really brings life back into your scalp and scalp. Health Nikki, you should cleaner. have your mom try this. Your mom should try this. Oh, good. So I good. will. I will. Does it have like a tingle factor? Nope. No, I haven't tried nope. it yet now. No, and I have to say, that's what's so funny is all these products, you know, um, I will give you a little, little uh, uh, education here. So uh, with Drunk <laughs> Elephant, so here is their, the Drunk Elephant difference. So the brand is committed to using only ingredients that either directly benefit the health of the skin or support the integrity of our formulation. So they never take into account whether something is synthetic or natural. Instead, they choose ingredients based on biocompatibility. So what that means in layman terms is, you know, we talked about this in the first episode with Drunk Elephant that when things are fragrance free, I have to be honest, I was kind of like, I don't yeah. know things smelling like coconut. I still, like, I still smell chemical. it. You don't need that. You don't need any sort yeah. of smell, yeah. And I will say that my other favorite products, I'm gonna use the Sea Tango Multivitamin Eye Cream. It is late for me here, so I'm going to use the eye cream. I'll show you how I apply it while Lisa mentions her favorite. And then I'll also put my oh. uh, TLC Framboose Glycolic Night Serum. This is what I use every single night. So the eye cream is going to go about here. Use the ring finger to have like a, you know, not too much pressure around your eyes. And then you'll see me mm -hmm. put on the, uh, the night serum, which is so light, so uh, refreshing to your skin. You can sleep in it. You'll never wake up feeling greasy because I hate that, you guys. Me too. I wake up feeling greasy from a product. Ugh. Or when you, or when you try a new product and you wake up, you're like, I just broke out. I have yeah. pimples now yeah, because it's so greasy, right? Yeah. Work it, work it out. I use the serum, they say I use the day serum during the day, that green, the orange serum, the citrus yes. serum during the day. And then I do this. So I just did the retinol cream the, uh, last night. I told you. Yes. Yeah. I'm out, so I do I'm out of it. So I used that last night and then I did it with that cream that you just used the the um the pink bottled one where is it yep. at i have it in the here night somewhere. serum yep yeah and then i wow. used it with this one which yeah i, I like that too one. yeah oh yeah too. i'm almost out of that one too i'm almost out this hydro intensive hydration oh this pink one yeah so i it's after so i light, put the right? retinol stuff on i used that serum right there that you're using and then i used this serum on top of it that's your favorite, the Hydra. Yeah, water-based. Mm -hmm. this, this is my favorite for nighttime. That's my hair. Yeah. Yeah, this nice. Hydra one is really, really nice. And then where's the, oh, it's downstairs. The blue one, the uh, ultra facial. The blue ah. one. So I'll use that with this. Then this Hydra one, I'll use it with the other lotion. For oh, nighttime. you guys like the little the little pink one, which was like the baby face something or other. That's and still I my didn't favorite have that too. The first time that one was interesting Ooh. because it's very tingly, but man, is it good! It's very effective. Yeah. And you weren't used yeah. to the tingly, but it's supposed to um, slough off the dead skin on top, and, it does. and then prevent new skin. Um, you guys, I was really skeptical. I'm gonna be completely honest. I'm not about face bronzers, but you know, like I'm, I'm not about. I don't like tanning my face, but I'm not 
one to say, I don't tan. Okay. So I'm out at the beach and, um, but I don't like to tan my face, but I'm like the hat starts, you know, cutting circulation off to my brain, you know, you know, I need some help up there, but I, I started, I was like, <laughs> so I added this because I bought a foundation that was too light for me and I added it uh -huh. to my foundation, but I don't have foundation on today. Um, that's what I have on and it comes out oh, wow. bronzy. Okay. I'm, I'm okay. I've already put a, a, like some on, you can see how dark and shiny. And I thought it was going to be too shiny because I'm going to, I have oily skin, but look how tan it got me. Dude. I know you look tan. No, like, no, I'm serious. And there's goes the eyebrow. That's why I will never do a show without my eyebrows, put it on, uh, painted on, but, <laughs> uh, I didn't put You're foundation glowing. on. Look, God, it doesn't even do it justice on this, the computer camera, you know, that, but well, that's why you should make sure you feels, guys this on social media because we're all promoting our different favorite products here for sure. And those sunshine drops are great. I also want to mention that the, you know, even, even in England, by the way, where we have had like barely any sunshine, whatever, you think you're not getting sun exposure. You know, I lived in Orlando, Florida. I was getting it every day, but there's still some sun exposure you should worry about, especially, you know, when you're like mid twenties uh, upward. Um, but this is the anti-pollution. It fights from pollution too. Pollution, Yeah. Protection. Oh, SPF 30. This yeah, one. that one, that one. I was really skeptical because I'm oily, oh. dude. I had that one too, Val. I haven't. I just opened it. I realized it was a tinted lotion. Yep. I love that. Okay. Yeah. What, what are you showing, Val? What we were just talking about now too? We had the sunshine drops. We also, like, like, like Mickey's showing, it is the Umbra Tint, uh, Umbra Tint, Physical Daily Defense Protection. Uh, it is SPF 30. It's a broad spectrum sunscreen and 20% zinc oxide. It's one of those things that you need to be putting this into your moisturizing routine before you put your makeup on. Because again, we think, oh, it's not sunny outside. You're still getting those rays and those pollution yeah. and uh, you know th these, these harmful rays that are hitting your face. And especially your face is the first thing to age. So don't scrimp yeah. on the sunscreen. And, and your up. neck. And you guys, your neck, do chest up on all these I'm 50 and yeah. I'm paying for it now. I'm very self-conscious about my neck and I tanned being a California girl. I tanned all the time. And now I'm like trying to go, Oh my God, I'm trying, you know, trying to catch up with the time, but yeah, the yeah. neck chest up. Yeah. yeah. No, it's very true. And you, I Lisa, say, honestly, uh, your, your words of caution for, for sunburn, like, you know, we've all done the thing where, Oh, I thought I had enough sunscreen on and you got so sunburned. And what did we say to you? Mickey and I were like, Oh my God, drunk elephant skincare will save you because you have to be so careful. With and I sent pleasure. you guys a picture of my burn and um, we're going to show it right here because I have to filter it because, you know, I have no shame. I sent them a, like, you know, you know, Are we gonna it's a not social it's a social peak. That's what it is. A social peak. Unburned social peak, Yep, I got sunburn. So I bought a one piece bathing suit, you guys. Long sleeves. And I went to go to my brother's house. We went to go ride in the bikes and I got burnt. And so I said, I bought a one piece bathing suit with long sleeves for Hawaii because I'm going to Hawaii, but I don't want to get, bur I, I burn. I'm half Puerto Rican. I don't know why I burn. And it had slivers on the side. I did not know that didn't have it on the picture. I got freaking so freaking burnt. You guys, I was in so much pain. My brother goes, are you wearing a gymnast outfit? And I'm like, I should have gone to dance supply and got a gymnast outfit. I could have got a bathing suit there, but I mixed this, that silly body lotion. I just this used one. it. Yeah, and I and I mixed it with aloe vera, yeah, to, to help my skin. And um, mm -hmm. yeah, I'm not yeah, I'm not peeling, I'm not peeling. And it was last weekend, and we're going to the beach this weekend <laughs> to no. get burned again. But. I don't need the graphic, <laughs> but I, I I because we're we're very honest. I told the ladies, I said, you know, my husband and I were sitting there watching something on the couch, and he happened to touch my leg, and I said, he goes, oh my god, like even he noticed that how how smooth. And, uh, you know, lovely, my skin felt with this. It's called yeah, Sleepy Body did. Lotion, um, Moisturize and Nourish. It has marula butter, uh, five ceramide blend, cer ceramide blend, and it is right, so good. Stuff. Full body lotion. Because again, Drunk Elephant is actually branching out into- uh, Put the lotion on its skin. On its skin. The the it's the hose again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Buffalo right. Bill approved. But they That's precious. Body lotions and hair care and things like that. <laughs> They even sent a wonderful deodorant that was actually really, really nice Ooh. and refreshing and lovely. Yep. Oh, really? I haven't tried it yet. But I, I haven't like either. I haven't either. I'm all about waste. I still have deodorant still left. And I like to use my products. I don't like to throw stuff away that I've used. Sweet and pity. then I'll start off my new stuff. You'll be impressed. What? Sweet pity is what it's called. Uh, yeah. 
You know what? When I saw the title, I for sure thought of you, Mickey, that I'm like, she should have a freaking deodorant light. Oh my God. Sweet pity. That's Sweet pity. So funny. Yeah. Does this have a scent? Does this have a scent? What do no, nasty people call sense. it? Pity City or Titty? I don't know. It's something terrible. Pity, pity City. It's Pity City. Classy. Kidding. I love them though. <laughs> I love me. I'm, some moms and yeah, I'm kind of curious now. Now, but it would have been funny back in like Attitude Era days. Yeah, you no, know. I was gonna say with this, with this guy, I use the. This is why I go like, oh, I don't. You know, I don't put on makeup every single day, but there's times when you do social media posts and stuff like that. I use their other sunscreen day lotion with this orange. There's a blue topped one that's yep. it's longer and it's like this, such as their day lotion. And I use that with this vitamin C stuff in yep. the day. I use that every day. Yeah. Now this tinted one could could save me, you know, time. Mm -hmm. a good tinted Add it to lotion. this. Add that one to this, Mickey, because you're dark tinted. Sunshine. Drops. You know, you're, you already you have a dark that like you have Native American. Like this will this will look really good on you. Do you find that guys that like, for example, when I go buy foundation and things like that, like I have to go, okay, so let me explain something that I do. So right now I'm very pale looking because you know, we're trying skincare, but in real life, real life Val, there she goes. Oh, Mickey, someone had to do it. You had to know someone it was gonna to be me. It. But in real life, I feel like I'm so much paler than when I'm doing a show and I've got all this fake tan on, I've got this faux tan. And for that reason, it's nice that we have these sunshine drops to kind of like get us to like that darker shade that we've, you know, faux tan to be. Because on a day where I'm not filming, I'm not working, I'm probably very, very pale compared to when I need to have the darker um, complexion in terms of the sunshine drops and the uh, the tinted moisturizer for sure. Because it, it, it does change. Yeah. All right. All right. Well, well, after that, I don't know how we follow that. I'll tell you how. A giveaway. You know, there you go. we're givers here. You know, that's what we do. So Not we're takers. doing a special giveaway. Tell us below. Tell us how you practice your favorite hashtag self care um, and give us some little tips, you know, because we always like to learn to be gorgeous here. Um, and we are going to reward our favorite entry, our favorite rot with a signed eight by 10 by all three of us. Yes. Yeah. Get out of town. Yeah. Get out of three town. Three signatures. What a national oh, treasure. Oh, Eight by oh, ten. Oh, mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Well, if you don't mind, uh, we've had so much fun in this episode. We want to thank you guys for being here again. We are going to be in the Patreon Zoom after party. Top of the hour, 6 p.m. Eastern. All of us are going to be on camera with you. Uh, having uh, the time of our lives, having a little late night cap with you and our friend Ella J and our fabulous friend Sal. Everyone in the chat room, you're all invited. But ladies, let's do a final cheers. May we? Yes. Oh, we love you guys so much. Sure. Thank you for being here. Yes. yes. Don't forget elephant, to subscribe. To subscribe. Well. Subscribe. And thank you, drunk, drunk elephant. This is the word. Go, yo, go.